must save her. My daughter. How's it going guys? Lucian Sword here, playing some more Breath of the Wild for you guys today. As always, hope you're having a fantastic day wherever you guys might be. Ooh. Hello. I see a chest. Raining treasure right off the bat. What do we get? Wow, only 12 damage. Actually, speaking of chests, uh, real quick, let's summon in a couple of amiibos. See if we get anything special. Oh, nice! A giant ancient core. Those are actually really, really hard to find. That was a really good drop. All right, let's do one more. Since we're on a we're on a roll. Come on, baby, give me something good. In today's episode, I want to continue hunting for. All right, an opal. Those EX chests. There's a bunch of EX chests that we're going to try to get. And I want to get all of them because there's so many cool uh, armor and treasure and stuff that you can get. Five ice arrows. All right, um, let's see. Where's Cookie? Come here, Cookie. Let's ride into battle over here because I noticed there's actually a chest... And a golden bow goblin. We're gonna mess them up. Oh, that's actually a bomb barrel. Alright, we are just killing like all of these guys. Ganondorf's sword is so strong. I always like to go for the weakest ones first. Good job, Wolfling. Keeping this guy from regenerating health. Yeah, just keep standing in the fire, dummy. Look at that health. All right, got the chest. He only dropped a sapphire. Well, still worth it, I guess. Um, actually, since we're sitting here, how am I doing on uh, cooking meat? I actually do have a lot of meat. Well, whenever I come across a fire, I like to cook any of my raw meats. Like, I guess I don't have any right now. Oh yeah, okay. Like some of these. Instead of cooking them one by one, I like to just drop them all right on top of the fire. Cook them all at once. Don't cook them too long, though, or they get burned. All right, let's see what we got in the chest. Wow, 50 attack on that bow. That's actually a lot of damage. That might be the most that I have other than the uh, line elbows. Oh, yeah. It's even more than the triple Lionel Bow, but I'm going to keep that because it still shoots three arrows, which is awesome. And I think I'm going to drop this one. This does literally double the damage, pretty much. Alright, so now we are going to try to find some of these EX treasures. I need to go find the journal, and it's located somewhere in the outpost ruins which are actually just right over there. So let's get back on Cookie and see if we can find this journal, which will help us locate the EX chest. We're gonna go through these ruins that I wanted to go through anyways, because there's probably secrets around here.
Thanks a lot, Cookie, for stopping right in front of the enemy. Appreciate it. Alright, these are the ruins. Right up here. Oh my goodness, Cookies. Come on. All right, close enough, close enough. Wasn't there like a enemy tower somewhere? I guess not. Ooh, there's a chest right there. All right, we found the outpost ruins. Dang, an even better royal bow. Why are we getting such good weapons? Um, wow, all right, guess I'm dropping this one. Incredible bow. Some dead guardians. Now somewhere around here we should be able to find the journal. Let's go ahead and break all these crazy. Wolf Link, where did you go, bro? <clears throat> Come on. Kill the slimes. Slimes are perfect for you to kill. Or I will. Whatever. Alright, so maybe in here. Got another chest sitting in the dirt, not an EX chest though. Amber. Okay, here's the journal, guys. We found it. Ancient mask lies at the ruins where soldiers gathered from there. The waters of Lake Kolomo are visible. Ruins of Hyro Field. The ruins where trade flourished. Ruins where sinners were imprisoned. Village ruins next to farmlands where many people once gathered. I'm probably going to have to look some of these up because they're a little bit vague. But let's see. All right. Well, here's like Kolomo. So let's just head up there. Uh, we need to go northwest. I think the Majora's Mask is by Lake Kolomo. Is there anything? There's probably more stuff in these ruins. But, oh well. Let's get on Cookie and let's head towards Lake Kolomo. I really hope we can find Majora's Mask because... Why are you stopping, Cookie? Oh my goodness, you are just so finicky. Uh, because it would be it would be cool to find. Okay, you die for that. I was going to leave you, but... Nope, you're dead. Now you all die. You all die because you blew his heart. Lotus horn, sorry. I was gonna leave you in peace, but no. Ooh, ten arrows. I'm getting more arrows than I'm using, that's for sure. We're done here. We're done. Cookie, you went way far. <laughs> I almost ran over that dude. Alright, so here's the lake. Another golden boy over there. Let's go kill the golden boy first. <laughs> Don't do it, Wolf Link. Okay, now you can. 
You're dead, you're dead, you're dead, you're dead. Good thing Ganondorf's sword has a lot of durability. Topaz. I like killing them because you get lots of monster parts, which are good for money. Random one rupee over here. And also, sometimes you get uh, arrows, which... I do want arrows. I don't see any. Opal. All right, all right. Pack of horses over there. All right, so where are, where's the, the EX chest? Should be somewhere in this lake or near it. Oh, let's go check over by the ruins over here. I bet you it's over here. Yeah. I bet you this is it. <laughs> Nothing? Oh, come on. It's got to be somewhere around here. Where's that EX chest? Man, nowhere? I thought for sure it'd be around here. What's over here? Is that like a stone talus in the middle of the island over here? Or is the chest over here? It is! I knew it! Not exactly what I was looking for, but... Not really doing that much damage. Ganondorf's sword is now dead. And now the stone Talus is dead. Diamonds? Nice, we got a diamond. Alright, where is the chest? It's gotta be here. It's gotta be somewhere around here, I know it. Let's keep looking by these ruins. It has to be these ruins, right? Like I said, right by Lake uh, Colomo. These are the only ruins I see by Lake Colomo. Where is it? Hmm. Oh, I think I found it. I think I found it. Oh yeah, that's an EX chest, baby. What we get? Oh, we found Majora's Mask, the Majora's Mask. Forget about Ganon, this is going to completely mess up the world. An eerie mask passed down from ancient times. Wearing it makes it harder for certain enemies to spot you. It's a rather rare find. Do we dare put on Majora's Mask? Whew. Oh my gosh, it even glows a little bit. Link, why would you put this on? It's gonna possess you with evil. Haven't you played Majora's Mask the game? By the way guys, if you enjoy Majora's Mask, definitely check out Zumwar's playthrough. He's got a really cool uh, Majora's Mask playthrough going on right now. All right, let's see. Next ancient, next EX chest. Wow, look at all these. Um, I kind of want the Dark Armor and the Usurper King. Let's go for the dark armor, I guess. 
Find these peace at the highest of three waterfalls north of Lake Floria, at the bridge between the small waterfalls, and at the broken stone bird of Ibarra Forest. Alright, so... The waterfalls... Let's see... Where is there a place where there's three waterfalls? There's Lake Floria. Did it mention Lake Floria? Yes. Highest of three waterfalls north of Lake Floria. That's what I thought. Alright. So we gotta go way... Way over here. Alright, let's head to this tower then. You should get, like, special powers when you use Majora's Mask. I mean, Skull Kid did. Skull Kid could do all kinds of crazy stuff. He turned Link into a Deku Scrub. I should be able to turn Bokoblins into Deku Scrubs or Lynels into Deku Scrubs. That would be so crazy. Alright, from here I need to go up the waterfalls. So I'm assuming it's somewhere like... Somewhere like around here. Let's just put a red marker. Now, I'm going to try to jump over there. Alright, that didn't work. That didn't work. That's okay. That's okay. A little bit of speed there. This part of the game is actually one of my favorite areas. It's like a jungle. At least we have the Zora armor now, so we'll be able to uh, swim up these waterfalls if we need to. Looks like we do. Some Octo Balloons. Lift that baby up. Nothing here? There we go. Hard left, hard left, hard left. Ooh, I haven't come across a Thunder Rod boy in a long time. Alright, see any chests around here? Nothing yet. I don't... Do I have another weapon slot? I do. Alright, cool. I got a lightning rod. Um... Is there, like, supposed to be a Korok? Ooh. Alright, maybe we found it. This could just be a regular chest. But it could be the EX. Yeah, it's just a regular chest. Five fire arrows, though. I'll take it. Uh-oh, it's... All of my bows are lightning. I guess I don't have a bow anymore. Alright, so we, we still need to find the EX chest. Did I go too high? Maybe... It... Ooh. Why is there like a giant metal ball in there? Wait, wait, there was something there. Alright, let's put on our uh, Zora armor. So I can swim. There was like a Korok thing there or something, yeah. 
Oh, that's cool. It's like on the other side of the waterfall. Let's just go down here. Maybe it is this thing right here. Ha! Oh, there is actually a chest right there. My goodness, this lightning. Oh, there's two chests. All right, let's see what we got. Not an EX chest, though. Purple rupee. No, 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 no. And an opal. What are those floating platforms? There's some crates and a chest. Oh, there's a chest right there, guys. Right underneath the waterfall almost. Dang, I looked right there earlier and I didn't see it. Maybe this is it. It is. It's the EX. What do we get? Ooh, Phantom Ganon Skull. Stealth up, all right. Dang, that's crazy. I wanna throw these up. Okay, well that works. What's in here? Another chest? I'll pass. Alright, so how are we doing on time anyways? Oh yeah, we got a little bit more time. Let's try to find the rest of the dark armor. Alright. At the bridge between the small waterfalls over... Floria River? Alright. There should be a bridge. I'm gonna guess like right here, probably. So let's head back to this tower. That's the only bridge that I see over Floria River, so. I've never been able to collect all these pieces of armor before, so I just really want to do it this time. Oh, is that a shrine? It really looks like one. And that's actually where we're going anyways. I need to go like right here. Oh boy. Okay, I backfired, backfired, backfired. I'm just gonna warp back to the tower and do it again. I could try to do a mid-air one, but I usually just get more power doing these type. All right, I do wanna, I do wanna go this way perhaps for about. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's because I don't have a bow equipped. Are you kidding me? It's because I don't have a stupid bow equipped, I couldn't go into bullet time. I was like, why is it not working? There we go. Yeah, there is a shrine over there, for sure. Oh boy. Alright, this is the bridge. Alright, let's heal up before I die from something really unfortunate. Kind of lame I had to waste a fairy like that.
Put down the bomb arrow, sir. Wow, Royal Shield with durability up plus. Wow, that's like the best shield we've ever found. Gonna drop my Lionel shield for this one. Wow. And there's a bunch of chests down there as well. Yep. 50 rupees. Oh, fire arrows, alright. Amber. Now there should be EX chest. Ooh, probably right over there. Alright, let's go check it out. Maybe this one. Oh, we're getting good at this, guys. So many EX chests. Oh, Phantom Ganon armor. Some believe this armor is in inspirited by a dark entity resembling the great king of evil himself. It's a rather rare find. No, of course it's a rare find. I'm not going to equip until we get the full set. But that does stealth up as well. Oof. All right, let's see if we can get the final piece before we end the episode. All right. Let's see. At the broken stone bird of Ibarra Forest. Okay, here's a Ibarra Forest. I guess we can go check this out. So let's just warp to Ibota Point and then uh, it's a little bit northeast of there. If we can get the full Phantom Ganon armor set in one episode, I would be very happy. Lakeside Stables, man, we haven't been here in like a long time. I want to talk to Beetle and buy some arrows. Hey, Beetle, I haven't talked to you in a long time, man. Oh, wow. He just gives me an ancient arrow. Thank you, dude. Yes, I have met Robbie. Uh, let's see. Do you have arrows? Oh, you are so great, Beetle. Wow. Let me just buy all of them. I don't really want to sell anything just because the only things that are worth selling are monster parts and gems. I could sell luminous stones, I guess. That's that's like the only stone that the uh, the gem lady doesn't buy. Let's just... I'm not going to use them for upgrades, probably. I'll sell 30 of them. I need to go back to Garan City because I have over 10 of every gem. Alright, let's look for that last piece of armor real quick. I'm gonna guess... Let's just follow this road. Floria Forest. I was gonna change my clothes, but it doesn't really matter because... I'm just gonna change them again once we find this chest. We gotta go across this bridge a little ways. Not even gonna waste my time with this guy. I already got that Korok, nice. Didn't these guys shoot me off the bridge too? I'm always getting shot off bridges. Or oh, he's shooting shock arrows or something. All right, is this it? All right, yeah, yeah. It should be. It should be near here. Look for some broken statues. Oh, here they are. Whoa. Oh, come on. What is the glowy eye? Alright, there should be a chest around here then. Oh, it's so laggy. Oh wow, we are too good. Too easy. I want to look at that glowy eyeball. 
Phantom Ganon Greaves. All right, hold on. What's that glowy eye? Is that like an emerald? Or a luminous stone? Just a luminous stone. Oh! Wow. I never would have thought there would have been a Korok in that eye. All right, cool. Now the time has come to embrace the Phantom Ganon armor and become the king of evil. Oh! Disguised and bone attack up. What? Oh my gosh, I look insane. I love that I have a cape. So I'm disguised. Ha 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 So does that mean enemies won't attack me? Cookie's like, you look different, master. No, nah, I just, I just, uh, I took a shower. There's nothing different about me. <laughs> Anyways, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed. Dang, I was really hoping I could levitate, you know? Phantom Ganon can levitate in Ocarina of Time. Oh, man, this looks sick, though. All right, all right. We'll go rescue this person real quick. Pick on somebody your own size. Drop it. You're dead. I tried to parry, but I didn't have a shield, but thankfully I got Daruk. Stop trying to kill people. It's not nice. What, are you gonna give me a monster elixir? Huh? Hey, it's Ty. Oh. Nothing? Wow. Thanks for nothing, bro. All right, guys. Oh wait, maybe she will give me something. Are they just scared of me because I look like Ganon? Probably. <laughs> All right, guys. This is Lucian Sword. Hope to see you in the next episode. They're so scared of me. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Like, really? What are you gonna do? That's what I thought. Take it easy, guys. <laughs>